Hey, what's going on guys? Um, so yes, I'm on GTA Online, the Biker DLC is out and we're going to be taking a look at all the new vehicles that's been added. Now this is the Hakucho Drag, um, that you can see now this one, it looks pretty cool, it looks like a sport bike obviously apart from this bit that sticks out at the back. To be honest, looks wise, it kind of puts me off the bit at the back i know it's because it's a drag bike and stuff and um, it looks nice but to be fair it's not my kind of style to be fair i don't really ride bikes that much on the game anyway but obviously with the biker dlc being out it's definitely one that i'm probably going to avoid i'll probably pick up a chopper but we're going to see how it handles and speed and stuff now straight away when you get on it it seems really really quick so definitely if you're going to use it for some races and stuff it looks all right um when you're on it, that back tyre, because it's so close to the camera, makes it look proper chunky. It makes it look quite nice. We'll see how it takes the corner. Not too bad, actually. Even though I went flying over the handlebars. Um, I mean, for a new vehicle that's been added, I know they're all quite expensive. Um, and now my bike's just been run over. But never mind. We can still get on it. We can still mess around. Um, yeah, all the bikes, they are pretty expensive, so to be fair, unless you're going to proper use the DLC, most people, chances are, are still going to carry on using the cars, um, just because it's easier. The only difference is, obviously, now you can use melee weapons and stuff, which is definitely pretty cool. But this one, the Acucho Drag, is probably one that I'm not going to use myself, but it's still pretty cool that it's in the game. Well, I hope you've enjoyed it, guys. If you want to see the rest of the bikes that have been added in, make sure you subscribe and check out my other videos. But for now, that's it, and I'll see you on the next one.